I'm gonna tell you about my favorite six add-ons that you're probably not using and that are totally gonna to help propel your business. Now, if you wanna open up your Google Suite and follow along, feel free to do so. We're gonna be talking about Google Docs, Google Sheets, and Google Slides. Okay, first off, a Google add-on is just like an extension for Chrome. Just as extensions add new features to the Chrome browser, add-ons extend the functionality of the Google Suite applications. So first I'm looking at my document. First thing I wanna do is find the add-ons tab up here and get add-ons. The first one we're gonna look up is the Pro Writing Aid. Now this is really, really similar to Grammarly. If you're not already familiar, this is ba both are basically AI writing assistants that help you maintain good spelling, good grammar, and it even helps you improve your writing because it gives you guidance on your style and your tone. So when you're ready to install, all you're gonna do is click install, and then it will have you sign into your Gmail account, and you're gonna allow it access to your Google Docs. For the sake of this video, let's just say you've done a research report. You're gonna highlight the text, come up here to add on, and go to improve document. It gives you a real quick rundown, but it's handy to see that your grammar and spelling are fine. You can even come over here and select different things. So uh, if you wanted to select email, it basically gives you guidance of uh, how well you're doing. The next tool that might be helpful for you is Translate Plus. Translate Plus is an awesome tool. It, uh, we're gonna install that. Translate Plus is an awesome tool because it translates text into other languages in your document. It's actually one of the easiest and quickest ways to translate your documents into other languages or vice versa to translate other languages right from your doc. So a good example of when you might use this is if your client is doing work with people all over the globe, you're going to copy and paste right in your document, come back up here to add-ons and translate. And what we can do is either auto detect the language or you can choose from the list here. I'm going to go ahead and choose Spanish and I'm going to translate it into English. When you're done choosing your to and from language, you're gonna come over here to this second tab. And if the text is highlighted, we're gonna hit translate. Google does a really good job of translating this super, super quick. And you can even insert that verbiage right into the document. There is no faster way to translate language than this tool right here. The third add-on we're going to get is called Doc Secrets. Google Docs don't come with passwords in and of themselves. So if you and your client are working on a document that's a secret, quote unquote, either from, um, you know, if you just want additional security on Google Docs or they're keeping it uh, hush hush from maybe people who, who are on their team and have access to their Google Docs as well, um, Doc Secrets is cool for two reasons. Um, number one, because you can set a password and you can even highlight and hide certain texts. Um, so if, if the entire document doesn't need to be hidden, um, you can just choose things that you want to keep out of other people's view. What I'm going to do is censor this text. So unless people have the passcode, they won't be able to reveal this text. So if you were looking at this document, for example, you wouldn't know the password and you wouldn't know what this was. The third tool that I feel like is really handy, by the way, is not actually an add-on, but it is something that I wanted to include. If you see this right here, this is a voice typing icon. I actually don't even know where this hides, so I always go up to the help bar and type in voice typing. So Google has its own click to speak feature, which I love because I can eliminate the need to type anything whatsoever, <laughs> period. As long as you have this feature enabled, Google will dictate what you're saying in real time, period. The thing that I like to use this for is if I'm doing research for clients and I just need to jot some ideas down or things that I'm reading that I wanna come back to later, period. Uh, you can also speak your mind freely and jot maybe ideas down for your own business. Um, so this speak, in real time, Google Voice tool is one of my favorites. Let's move over really quick to the spreadsheets tool. There's just one add-on that I want to bring to your attention right now, and that is remove duplicates. 
So if you're ever doing a big data project for clients and you have rows and rows and rows and rows of data, removing duplicates can be super handy because it helps eliminate any errors on your part. So let's just pretend that you're, it's not uncommon when you're doing a big data project that you're like 300 rows of data down and then you realize that you either lost your way or there's so much data on the sheet that you don't remember the last row that you left off and maybe you accidentally duplicated some detail. Um, all you would do when you have all sorts of data over here is uh, just come up and highlight remove duplicates. And this add-on goes through all of your data for you and it highlights it. If you notice this trial expiring, by the way, I do wanna let you know that you can run one search per day for free. And finally, I'm moving over to slides. If you ever find yourself helping to build a presentation or help your client edit a presentation, there's an add-on that I absolutely love and it's the Pexels add-on. Sometimes the most time consuming part of building a presentation is looking for photos and stock photography. So once again, we're going to add this to our profile. We're gonna give it access to our slides and in within seconds, you'll be able to search for free really good quality photos right within the slide deck itself. And I love that because there's no need to go to the Pexels website and flip back and forth. So bing, bang, boom, I found the photo that I want. And all we're gonna do is insert that photo. So those are all my favorite extensions. I hope you guys found value in this video. By no means do you have to download every add-on that I've talked about, but I do think that these are some of the most helpful ones that are gonna help your VA business get faster and better and help you be a more proactive VA. Thank you guys so much for sticking around and I'll see you on the next video.